that preventive dental care begins at birth. A new baby should have their gum pads wiped off after every feed with a washcloth and water. And that removes all the residual milk that is left on the teeth. And from that day forward, preventive care should occur on a daily basis. A healthy tooth requires that when it's erupted into the mouth or it comes into the mouth initially, that tooth isn't fully mineralized. If a tooth is covered immediately with milk products or juice right from the get-go as it's coming into the mouth, that final mineralization will not occur properly and that tooth will be more prone to breaking down. But once teeth start to erupt when they're six months of age, they need to be cleaned at least once a day well, ideally before bed. If the teeth are physically touching each other, then you start to floss. And yes, you floss at six months of age. The baby teeth also occupy the space where the, and act as guides for the permanent teeth. And that affects the child's bite and impacts them for their whole life. Preventive dental care is the most cost-effective treatment that one can provide. If a parent or caregiver starts the prevention at birth and continues on for that child's life, the cost of dental care is minimal. The costs increase if decay becomes present. And many people say they can't afford to have dental care done because these teeth are going to fall out. And that sadly is a fallacy because they can't afford not to get it done because of the severe medical impact that that can cause that child. Each tooth is part of a whole body. Each tooth has its own blood supply. Each tooth has its own nerve supply. Uh, all feeling on the, that occurs in a tooth is interpreted in the child's brain. All infection that's in a child's tooth can get into the child's bloodstream and can circulate anywhere in the body and can cause serious problems to the point where in the extreme situation, some children have had brain abscesses secondary to dental abscesses. Dental decay in children under five is the most common chronic infectious disease in children in North America. I hope that all parents will learn to understand the importance of oral health. We just can't overemphasize the importance of initiating preventive care at birth and how important it is and cost effective that preventive care is in ensuring that that child grows with a dynamic smile without complications of disease.